Hey team, I actually have my Blitz uh, shirt on and this video is about blitzing. So, you know, we talk a ton and ton about um, social media and things, uh, ways to grow your business and social media is an amazing tool because it's right there in your hand every day. Your customers, you know, they're looking at their phone every day. But there's another way to build your business that, you know, I uh, want to make sure you, you're utilizing it, you understand and it's called blitzing and blitzing is simply you know sharing what we have so there's you know our main way to blitz let me grab one you know when we talk about blitzing we kind of mean our blitz card so this is our business card um you can order these from myworkstore.com you should have got a few in your kit um you can actually laminate one put it on a lanyard wear it around your neck um you can just take a picture of this and when somebody says blitz rep repeat what's that and you're like, oh, well, let me show you. And you can show them this on your phone and you can say, I can text you this coupon and boom, you have their number. But anyways, um, blitzing, you always want to have these in your car, in your purse. You always want to have these on you. So if somebody stops you because of a shirt you're wearing or, you know, if there's somebody that knows you and they're like, oh, you're looking skinnier. What are you doing? You know, I would grab my blitz card, let this do the talking for you instead of somebody saying, what's it works? And you just kind of vomit on them like oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. Uh, overwhelm them you just think if you were in their shoes if you pick this up and say well this this is what it is um this is what it is it's a wrap you can put it anywhere from the neck down and this is what it does let them read it let it soak in let them ask the next question um you know before you start spitting out too much information always just kind of let them ask and answer let them ask and answer you know, if they look really interested, you can turn it back over and say you can try one for $25 or you can even try one free if you want to get a few friends together. So that's the Blitz card. I can give you a ton of tips um, on blitzing. Um, but I wanted to make this video too about, you know, intentional blitzing. So you can make yourself a goal to hand these out, you know, five a day, 10 a day, whatever your goal is. And, you know, simply when I'm checking out somewhere, I just grab two or three and I say, here's some coupons for you and your friends. Um, so I'm not running around to people saying, hey girl, you need to wrap. Here's your coupon. Um, I, I just call it a coupon and I just say, here's a coupon for you and your friends. Or I'm introducing a new product to the area. You may be interested. Just want to get you a coupon. So I kind of use that verbiage, give it to them. Most people just say, thank you. If they ask some questions or seem kind of interested, then we'll make clear on the conversation. If they seem really interested. Um, I always have wraps on hand as well. And I say, I can wrap you right now. Um, it'll just take a couple minutes in the restroom or in a break room or something like that. Put it on, you can wear it for an hour while you're at work and you can tighten tone and firm while you're at work. And so I've done a lot of that as well. Um, some other things you can do is actually go around and kind of target businesses. Um, there's just so many options and opportunities. Um, if you do kind of target businesses, you know, you can think about boutiques, salons, uh, gyms, um, just just all kinds of businesses out there, daycares. Um, you know, if you take your kids to daycare, ask if you can leave some coupons or at the dry cleaners or anywhere you frequent, restaurants, see if you can leave some coupons there for their customers. But you know, if you're targeting uh, boutique type places or salons or gyms, you know, you can go in and ask if they have uh, vendor appreciation days, I mean vendor days or customer appreciation days or you know, some type of ladies night. Um, see if they have anything like that. That can be your actual way to open the conversation instead of coming in, you know, I'm miss at work. You can just come in, mess around, kind of talk to them, see if they have anything like that. If they do, see if there's any way you could be a part of it. You could come in, set up, um, pamper their guests, give, uh, serve some green tea detox juice, offer wraps if they want to wrap, things like that. Maybe offer some wow. Um, <clears throat> or, you know, if they don't have anything, you can suggest that. And you know, make it all about them. Make it all about how this could be an event to spur more business for them in their store. Um, if you let them, if they let you come set up, um, you'll advertise the event out there. So it'd be advertising their business, drawing more people to their business. Um, you know, so that's an option. You can also just go in and see if there's any way that you can have a few minutes with the owner because you want to offer them a free product. If the owner gives you a few minutes of their time or an hour of their time, I would offer the owner a free wrap. I would not go offer every employee a free wrap, but if an owner of a salon, boutique, um, gym, anything like that is going to 
give you some of their valuable time. I would wrap them for free because once you get that product on them, the wrap's going to speak for itself. It's going to sell itself. And then you can just kind of talk about how uh, this is a great add-on service to anything else they may be doing um, or just, you know, kind of an upsell, a great retail product. Um, it's also a great product to kind of attract new business. Maybe people would come into the boutique if, if they saw their advertising wraps and then they may buy a shirt too. Um, so, you know, talk about all that and how, you know, they don't have to carry an inventory. They can have a few wraps on hand and again, you know, people just order as a loyal customer. It ships direct to them. So they're not, um, you know, they're not spending thousands on inventory. That's what businesses are used to doing. So just kind of talk to them, um, make it about them, not about you, to talk about how you can help them. With business owners, um, I normally don't go big into the team building right off the bat because they're already running a business. Um, most business owners are going to think they don't have time to build a business. Once they get in, get their feet wet, kind of start understanding how this works, then you can kind of let them know, hey, if you're really wanting to make maximize our comp plan, you know, look, we could look at you going Ruby or Diamond, you know, what kind of income are you needing and stuff like that. So those are just some of the ways that um, I've approached businesses over the years and um, you know you can reach out to them on social media as well but I think going in um, is key and you know I just here to um, encourage you to to do that I know it's scary to go in but you know I always have a mindset of um, I'm offering a gift I mean number one you're offering a coupon if you go in and you just leave a few coupons for the um, employees there that's awesome. Who doesn't want a coupon? That is not invasive. That is not anything that people are going to freak out over. Um, you're offering them a chance to wrap for $25 or the, or the owner a free wrap or business ideas, you know, with customer appreciation days and things like that. So, um, you know, the worst that can happen is they can say, oh, thanks for the coupons. You know, we're busy right now or, oh, no, thank you. I've already, I'm already a customer or something like that. But nothing bad is going to happen, but your confidence is going to soar. You're going to be so proud of yourself and your business will thank you for it. So I just want to give those tips, uh, some more face-to-face -face business tips that you can um, kind of take control with because sometimes social media takes a little longer to build those relationships and this is something you can do while you're out and about or you know maybe you're already out shopping so why not you know see if you can get a wrap on that owner or set up a vendor night. So all right guys talk to you later.